<laughs> Nunu Jobe knows the bush intimately. He was an antelope poacher in his youth and now as a ranger at the Hlufluwe Imfolozi Park in South Africa's Guazulu Natal province, he's using his skills to protect wildlife, including rhino. Nunu also draws on his unique experiences to educate school children and communities living near the park about conservation issues. Most of the guests of which are like international or white people, and it's always more like in English. And so I said, it's it's unfair for people, local people, because they don't get a chance, you know, like to see what is inside. At the other hand, how can how what are we expecting from them if they don't know what a rhino is? And I was a poacher before, but now I'm a conservationist. In 2017 alone, more than 1,000 rhino were poached in South Africa, including 270 killed here in Guazulu Natal. This school group, the first to visit the park with Nunu, learned firsthand about the impact of poaching. Nunu now believes that conservation is his true calling and to be closer to nature, he hung up his boots and decided to go barefoot two years ago. As soon as you wear shoes, then you, you, you make your feet more softer and then so you're getting weaker and weaker. But as soon as you decide to quit not wearing shoes, on that day, then you start gaining something. Of which, that I said, you know, I'd rather gain something than losing something. And again, I feel more grounded and I feel like connects. I feel like sharing the step with the rhino. Game rangers like Nunu are now on the front line of the war against poaching, often confronted with former accomplices, and they rely heavily on community conservation awareness to try stem the tide while the continent's rhino population continues to dwindle.